Wisconsin Democrats are making some big decisions about who should take on Republican Governor Scott Walker in a recall election. The primary is Tuesday. According to a recent poll, the Democratic frontrunner is Milwaukee Mayor Tom Barrett. He lost to Walker in the 2010 gubernatorial election. So it was a bad year for Democrats. But in that horrible environment, I held Scott Walker to 52 percent. Now, I think the reason people forget that is because he's governed as though he had won with 92 percent um, by completely ignoring all the people, not, not ignoring, in many instances, trying to go after the people who didn't support him in 2010. The recall effort started after Walker effectively ended collective bargaining for public workers last year. He said it was needed to balance the state's budget. Former Dane County Executive Kathleen Falk was the first to get into the recall race in January. Well, I'm the better candidate because uh, I can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Scott Walker in 35 days. You know, Governor Walker lost more jobs in Wisconsin than any other state in the nation. And while I was county executive uh, for 14 years, uh, Dane County grew more jobs than any other county in Wisconsin. So I've got the best record to go toe-to-toe -to -toe against Scott Walker. She has the support of the state's teachers union. The Milwaukee teachers support her as well. And she is the strongest candidate, in our opinion, who is going to support public education and has been most active in the struggle against the Walker policies. Walker has raised $25 million, and big-name conservatives like New Jersey Governor Chris Christie are campaigning for him. Barrett and Falk have only raised $1.8 million combined. Uh, I, I predict if the truth gets out, we'll win. Plain and simple. If people see the facts, if they see that unemployment has dropped the lowest it's been in 2008, when they see that for the future, it, it's pretty it's clear. Do you want to go forwards or backwards? He has another month to campaign for his job. The general election is June 5th. Carrie Antelfinger, Associated Press, Milwaukee.